All right, we think Cameron, uh... He might have just burnt the steaks. Oh, my God. Dude, <laughs> the smoke. <laughs> Look at all the smoke, dude. Man, it's hot, dude. So they aren't burnt? No, they're not. Are you sure? <laughs> I don't really know. Listen. <laughs> Welcome back to Cooking with Cookie, Cooking episode with two. Cookie. This is called Cookies. It's not too vocal. What are we cooking up today? Fake chicken. Fake chicken, not chicken. Just Baby. chicken without the E. Oh, is that what, that's what they do? I don't know. Just ease without meat. <laughs> <laughs> Turn this into a commercial of you eating Domino's wings. If you were born 11 years ago, how old would you be? 11? Gosh. Have you seen this? No. I whispered it. Have you been? Don't JT, if you were born 11 years ago, how old would you be? Oh, I'd be 11. Sing it! It's like a thing on TikTok right yeah, now. People well, will... what I was going to do is do the year and then add 11. I was like, well, I'd just be 11. Right, a lot of people like subtract, their, subtract age. their age from it. But if you were if you were born twelve years ago, how old would you be? Twelve years. So I'd be ten. <laughs> I don't know, dude. If you were born twelve years ago, you would be twelve years old. What? Yes. <laughs> I think I get really tickled, so. <laughs> Just let him, right? <laughs> I need to play dead to <laughs> not be ticklish. Oh. Uh, you have a big ear. <laughs> it sounds like pop rocks. It's like Skrillex. Oh, you're you're yanking my hair like do it to Alex. No. <laughs> say heck no, baby. That's how you do it. No, I'll pass. I thought you were gonna say yelling in my ear. <laughs> what are you doing? Yelling in my ear? Oh. What the f are you doing? Who the hell are you? Come up screaming my ear. Oh, I'm about to go to bed. Like really? It. Yeah, I got to wake up, dude. Oh, yeah. I'm a Division One baseball player. <laughs> Forgot. And you swing metal in college. Everybody knows that. Switching to wood here. In college, we do swing metal. Professionally, swing wood. <laughs> in college, we do swing metal. <laughs> hey, guys. I was just going to let you know. Um, we got plenty of space <laughs> over there if you guys wanted to... No? No, I was just saying that you look a little cramped. Sit down comfortably on the couch. Why do you want to do that? Why would I want to do that? I don't do the whole Tim's thing. I'm sorry. Oh, you have a girlfriend. That's confusing. We're not going to do that. You should have saw the clip I got of him today. Super sus. What are you looking at? What? I swear, I'm with my girlfriend. I'm going to walk over here. Better not. Okay. All right. Yep. There it is again. Dude, you got to relax. Yeah, you got me. Hey, are you confident you guys are dating, or is it just like a little fling? She's so she so has no idea what I'm talking about. I know he plays baseball, but I'm pretty sure he swings both ways. You know what I mean? <laughs> so this kid's crazy. Oh yeah, dude. It looked like you were not able to do that. Like <laughs> mentally, you just were not able. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think y'all are dating, dude. <laughs> this is their one year anniversary. As we go deeper in here, I started to realize that I've taken almost all of these. Took these. You guys can just sense just the pain. Oh, I'm so sorry. The pain behind the <laughs> camera. Like such romantic photos. Just beautiful <laughs> you took them. kissing photos. I was just sitting there like this. <laughs> All right, hi guys, what's up? Uh, okay, so for today's video, or for part of it, I'm going to show you guys what I do to work out or stay healthy. Um, just a few little tips. It's not gonna last very long. If you don't like health stuff, then skip ahead, but you probably should listen. This is gonna be quick, but I just wanna show you guys what I do at the gym, 
and what I do to kind of stay healthy, stay in shape. So let's uh, start with getting dressed. So uh, currently got a nice pair of Under Armour shorts. It's my go-to. Uh, I think I'm the only guy in the universe that wears Under Armour shoes, but uh, freaking love Under Armour shoes. I don't need Lululemon. All I need is a nice Walmart wife beater. Can't go wrong. Oh, just ripped it. <laughs> All right, last step to a perfect gym outfit. The chubby chain. Oh yes, sir. By the way, these sold out and I got way more orders than I was ever expecting to get. So thank you guys for that. You guys are incredible. Uh, I said they're gonna be available for 72 hours and they were, but if you didn't get one, I'm gonna open them back up for another 48 hours this time. So you can go get one of these real quick at alexhart.store. There's the gym outfit, got the wife beater and necklace on. So looking like Bryce Hall, ready to hit the weights. So there's two things I always carry when it's time to work out. First is an energy drink. Today I got a 3D energy drink by Christian Guzman. He's a YouTuber, check out his videos. I love 3Ds, these are incredible. This is the orange one, but I normally drink the blue ones. Tip number one, and I know people say this a lot. I'm not kidding when I say drinking a gallon of water a day will change your life. That is a big statement, I understand that. But I'm not kidding, it really will change your life. Like first benefit, makes you feel way better, gives you energy. I'm not sure why, but it just gives you energy because your body is made up of water. So it's like, it fuels you. If you don't go to the gym at all, your first step should be drinking a lot of water because you'll feel better, you'll feel cleaner, you'll look cleaner, your skin gets better, your hair gets better, your face gets more defined the more water you drink. I don't know how that works because it, it feels like the more water you drink, the more you'd bloat but your face gets skinnier uh, when you drink more water. Second tip, eat healthy. Everybody knows this. You can go to the gym all day long. All day long. But if you're not eating healthy, you're not gonna notice any difference because eating is like 80% of it. It's the hardest part. Okay, I, I will admit though, you do kind of look like a douchebag carrying around a jug of water. Like, if this isn't the most Bryce Hall situation you've ever seen right here. Good grief. My neck is unbelievably large. Thank you. Thanks, thanks look like the guy the net guy from the prison picture all right we're at the gym literally the gym it's literally called the gym really creative name design just found my buddy parker if y'all saw him in my snap story <laughs> how you gonna call me over here to make me sit <laughs> kid just called me to come over to his truck before I walked in the gym and I've been sitting here for 10 minutes waiting for him to get off the phone so <laughs> you missed class number three I should have known you're in class by your neon shirt do you have any other colors of shirts <laughs> That's all I got. So uh, did you reschedule your classes for a little earlier so that I wouldn't get it on camera? No, 4.30 every Wednesday. Oh, you, you should have told content. me that. <laughs> I'm 100% coming back next week to film Parker in his class. All right, so uh, I don't actually know if you guys care about my workouts or if you even want to see this, but uh, I'm going to show you anyways. And if you don't, just skip and you can see me next video. <laughs> but So I'm doing arms today. And uh, so the first one I did was just uh, preacher curls. When I do workouts, I'll do an explosive lift up and then I'll do slow and controlled down and it just helps me get a better pump. But the main thing to focus on when you're working out is getting your body to the point where you start burning. If you don't feel something burning during a workout, then you haven't actually started to affect the muscle yet. Once you feel the burn, that's when you're making progress. And that's why most people don't make a lot of progress in the gym because when they feel the burn they stop but when you feel the burn to me it's when I tell myself this is when the workout is actually starting that's when you actually start to affect your muscles so whenever you work out go in with the intention of trying to get yourself to burn on every exercise you want to feel your muscle burn because that is when you're making progress drink a lot of water eat healthy and work out with intention to burn your muscles every single time. And you do that consistently, and I promise you, your body will have no choice but to make changes. I normally get in the sauna after, but there's like five people in there. There's no way I'm filming in there with five dudes in the sauna naked. So just uh, take my word for it, get in the sauna. It's really good for you, and drink a lot of water. A lot of water, sauna, consistent in working out. That's my uh, keys to a healthy life. <laughs> What that would have sucked if yeah. Tom Brady transferred and then, like, transferred. You keep saying transferred. <laughs> yeah, you redshirted, transferred. Georgia? What do you got on your face? You, uh, do your makeup today or something? You should have saw the clip I got of him today. 